Hey guys, long time no see. Um, I got a few new things for my uh, tablet, as you can see. One second, I'm actually moving something. It's just in the way of my chair. Okay, I'm done. Sorry. I'm, I've actually, uh, my studio setup has been actually moved around since the last time I filmed. And I've been busy with some other crap. You're actually, I'm actually filming while I'm moving my desk around. Okay, well you can see that I got this leather case for my Nexus 7. And a stylus. It is actually pure metal. It's not hollow at all, so it's not cheap. It was actually uh, five bucks for one. But uh, here's the leather case. It is faux leather, so it's not real leather. I would feel bad if I did get real real leather. So as you can see, it has it's a pretty. Remove my light, my light, lighting. So as you can see, um, it's got a nice little leathery feel. It's got this little area right here. But here's the, one of the downsides of that. See how long this is? Right, hold it like that. It sometimes overlaps, and that's with all it like that. And it even holds that up. And I'm gonna write it, but it, but that's how it's supposed to be. So you can see right there, that's how it's supposed to be. I can be. I'm trying to see my screen at the same fucking time. So as you can see, that is how it's supposed to be, all even. So, but uh. It has magnets, but uh, it has a stand. It's also a stand. Has a, um, a stylus holder, so it's very nice. Does it get in the way at all? From what I can tell. Um, it has uh, um, six speaker holes. This is where the speaker is, obviously. Um, it has cutouts for everything. The side buttons are really hard t to actually uh, press since you had to dig your hand in there and sometimes they're not really hard to, to sometimes they're really hard to fi actually find to actually find when using the tablet because they're like that but it has um, your headphone jack and the micro USB as you can see, the micro USB is kind of not centered. That's because it lo it's really loose in here. So, and also, it's a magnetic case. So there, there's a magnet. I'll show you where the magnets are located. This is the sensor magnet. And these are the locking to the tablet magnets. Locking to the case. Locking, keeping the tat the cover closed. So as you can see, it's a perfect cutout, um, and it has a, a camera cutout right there. So yeah, I'm going to show you one thing, how it is controlled. See, not how it's controlled, but it has a microphone port right there too, since there's a microphone right there. And also, it, it has a Velcro, so let me take it out so I can show you. Oh yeah, one second, I didn't have a alone time. Back guys, <laughs> I just like to feel my tap, hold my tablet without the case on it. So, but I'm gonna show you how it looks, how the cat tablet looks. So you can see it has a Velcro right there, Velcro, and then Velcro right there. Um, this could be a little bit raised so that this doesn't have to sink in, and a little bit larger. But it's really strong leather, I mean uh, fat, uh, Velcro. You can see all the cutouts and everything. It's, I think this is. Uh, I have no idea what kind of material this is. So, but um, I'm gonna put tap loaded in, tap it back in, so you can see the staining position.
Oh, and I've got a surprise for you guys. Um, I'm getting a a surprise unboxing that has nothing to do with uh, Android, but it has something to do with Google. So yeah, oh yeah, that's the case. Oh, and the pin is pretty much just like a basic stylus. It has a nice little point right there. Soft and squishy. Um, it's metal. Um, it's solid metal. It's got a a clip, and also so you're gonna use it as a land, put on a lanyard. So that's pretty cool. And this case was twenty bucks. I think it was twenty five with the stylus. So if you want to buy them separately, you can do that. So yeah, thank you for watching and some app reviews will be coming soon.